French prosecutors request Le Pen's parliamentary immunity be lifted. Judges investigating far-right presidential candidate Marine Le Pen's alleged misuse of EU funds have asked for her European parliamentary immunity to be lifted. MEPs have already lifted her immunity in a separate case. With just nine days to go until the French presidential election, the legal woes of our right candidate and leader of the National Front footnote Marine Le Pen took yet another twist on Friday. According to a judicial source, French prosecutors investigating Le Pen's alleged misuse of European Union funds to pay for party assistance have asked for her European parliamentary immunity to be lifted. Signed on March 29 and filed with the prosecutor's office and the Justice Ministry, the request is unlikely, however, to be approved by European lawmakers before the April 23 election. Ask on Francine Fo TV station whether she would call on MEPS to reject the request, Le Pen said, it's a debate that we will have at the European Parliament's legal committee and decline to comment further. Le Pen was already stripped of her parliamentary immunity in a separate case last month. The move allowed a Paris court to prosecute her for posting images of Islamic State as brutality on Twitter in 2015. Waning support according to some analysts, Le Pen's refusal to go to a police summons over the EU funds allegations may have played a role in declining support for the right-wing populist in recent weeks. An Ipsos poll published on Sunday sees Le Pen make the second round of the presidential election with 22% of the vote. However, the footnote front woman looks likely to lose out in the runoff to independent Emmanuel Macron with 63%. Opinion polls had a huge shake-up this week after far-left candidate Jean-Luc Mélenchon enjoyed a surge in support. Once a distant fifth in the running for the French presidency, the communist-backed candidate's trademark quick wit and eloquent anti-capitalist discourse delivered over to televised debates have catapulted him into third in the polls. This year's French election has been characterized as a contest between the traditional center ground and a wave of anti-establishment populism. Economic stagnation and lackluster job growth have shifted support, however, toward what were once considered the fringes of the spectrum.